Tonight's top story attended El Paso County Under Sheriff Joe Royball follow the rules when he collected signatures to get on the primary election ballot for sheriff. That's the question now raised just days after he unofficially won the primary. News 5's Natalie Chuck is joining us now. And Natalie, this all comes down to a video posted on Facebook. Right, Diane and Rob, the video was posted by Dragon Man's Gun Rage in Colorado Springs on February 20th. Roy Ball is seen in the video with Dragon Man, but some people say what Dragon Man offered for the signatures is illegal. I love you all. Thank you very much. Celebrate. Just a couple of days after an unofficial victory in the primary elections for El Paso County Sheriff, current under sheriff Joe Royball is now under fire for a video from months before. The video on Facebook shows the owner of the gun range, Dragon Man, is standing next to Royball saying, quote, If you guys come out here today and use my shooting range and sign Joe's petition, we're going to knock off $5 off the shooting range price. A few seconds later, Later, Roy Ball acknowledges what Dragon Man says, saying, thanks Mel, appreciate you. But in Colorado, you can't pay or offer a discount for a signature. The statute says specifically anyone petitioning to get on an election ballot acknowledges he or she has not paid or will not in the future pay and that the affiant believes that no other person has paid or will pay directly or indirectly any money or other thing of value to any signer for the purpose of inducing or causing the signer to sign the petition. The gun range manager tells me they were not familiar with the election rules and had no idea they were doing anything wrong. I asked for an interview with Roy Ball and instead was sent a statement that says in part, at the time of the video, I was not aware the discount would be offered for each signature obtained. I was surprised and did not know he was going to make this statement. It was not planned nor coordinated with me. He added, quote, if I'd had a full understanding of the rules at the time, I would have intervened. The statement says Roy Ball collected, quote, about 43 valid signatures at the gun range. The El Paso County Clerk and Recorder's Office says Roy Ball had more than 1,500 of the 1,000 signatures required. Roy Ball's opponents in the race for sheriff now want the district attorney's office to investigate. District Attorney Michael Allen has previously endorsed Roy Ball for sheriff. A DA spokesperson says we have seen the video and we are currently reviewing available information. The News 5 is not showing the video because we don't have permission from the person who took it. I asked the Secretary of State's office about the video, but they would not comment in case anyone files a complaint and they have to investigate. They say as of this morning, no formal complaints from the public had been filed with them.